I like to tell you guys when I'm having a flare up, just so that you see what it's like. That's not why I'm in bed with a blanket though. I'm just comfy and taking in the golden hour. Do you see this? Fellas, be careful out there in them streets, man. If you haven't noticed, this woman has genital herpes and she's having a flare up and she's making a video about it. And she's trying to make it like it's sunshine, flowers, and rainbows. Now, I've known guys in my life, and you know, my man, obviously myself, and there's like this uh, preconceived notion that if a woman is pretty, um, she's beautiful, um, that she's good, that she's clean, that she um, can do no wrong, okay? You have to be very careful because first of all, genital herpes is something that you get and it stays forever. It's part of your life. There's a lot of complications that come with that. There's a lot of people that won't even tell you that they have herpes. They figure if I don't have an outbreak, I don't have to even say anything. If you don't really know about herpes, I suggest you go look that up. Be careful when you're out there in them streets, drinking alcohol, messing with all these loose women, because that could be you, bro. That could be you. Ladies, same message for you. Be careful. Because, you know, I know a lot of people have people in their families that have herpes. There's a couple in mine. I'm not exempt for that. I know what time it is. And both of these people that it happened to, it happened to when they were very young doing stupid things taking stupid risks fellas be careful man okay so literally what i'm feeling is and I, i'll let you know like i am on the antivirals daily lately i have been since before the summer because i was just like i don't want to deal you know all it is is like i'm itchy in one little spot is there anything visible there nope can there be something visible that comes in a day or two? Yeah, it'll probably keep itching and become like a little bump. And then eventually if I left it alone and didn't take an antiviral or didn't put an ointment on it, it might become a blister and then it would heal and go away. Does it hurt? No. Do I feel anything else with it? No. I'll keep you posted. Ew, it's just nasty. But you notice how she's trying to min minimize it. She's trying to make it seem like it's not a big deal. Like it's just, you know, like a hair bump or, or something like that. You know what I mean? But fellas, it is not a small thing. It's a big thing. And there's been other videos where I've seen that women ha that have uh, herpes that are justifying not telling men that they have it when they have sex with them. So fellas, you know, I could put a whole bunch of these videos up, but I think you get the point. Be careful, protect yourself, and remember this, a condom is not gonna protect you from herpes 100%, because herpes can live in the hair that's in your groin area. You know, it stays around for a long time. So just wearing a condom is not good enough. You need to be careful and you need to be hella selective in the women that you sleep with. And Lord, like I said earlier, Please don't think that women that are attractive like her are clean, are safe, that they would never do anything like that because they will. There's a lot of women that look just like her that have herpes. Some of them have other STDs. Be careful. You can get herpes from doing not just the normal, you know, uh, uh, how, how should I say, traditional sexual act, right? We, the act that produces children. You can get it from doing other things that are sexual too. So be careful, be smart, be selective in who you deal with. Pay attention to how these people move in the streets because I could tell you what, as pretty as this girl is, if you pay attention to her patterns, you pay attention to what she does, that probably tells you a whole lot about who she is as a person. I mean, just look at this video in itself. 
how she's trying to minimize the fact that she has herpes. And she's like, oh, dude, it's just a bump. It'll go away. And if I didn't do anything, it would just, you know, turn into a sore or whatever and just flake away. Like it's no big deal. So if they can get in videos and pretend like it's really not a big deal, what do you think she's going to do when you land in the bed with her? She's going to do the same thing. It's not a big deal. She might not even tell you. And I'll give you a last thought from my own experience. Years ago, there was this beautiful Hispanic woman that I met at a club. Met her at a club. Within the next week, we went out again. Then we ended up at her house. I mean, and I'm talking about super beautiful, right? She had uh, two kids, I believe, and they were like uh, both under the age of 10. And I was like, why isn't the dad around? She, you know, he's a bad person. He did snap, blah, blah, blah. So it gets down to the point where it's starting to get hot and heavy and all these things, right? And she says, you know, I just have to tell you that I have herpes. And I was like, uh, <laughs> you know what I mean? And she was like, does that change your mind? I was like, yeah. But it's not really a breakout. I don't have a breakout. I mean, and I take medication and, and other people that I've been with um, haven't caught it. I was like, what? Men have actually slept with you knowing that you had it? Bare balls? And they took that chance. She's like, yeah, yeah. And nothing ever happened. I was like, well, I'm not going to be one of them. She thought that I would be just like these other guys that would just accept it and take a chance on my health. You see? So, guys, be careful, man. Because these women, they're out there. A lot of them don't take responsibility or accountability for anything. And they will get you caught up all day, every day. You might wake up the next day with a breakout yourself. You have the power to achieve anything you want. Don't let anything or anyone distract you from your goals. And remember, stay focused, stay strong, and stay positive. Make sure to like, subscribe, and share this video with those in need.